Venga, a ver. I love your pantalones. Thank you. Twenty years later, you can sing the song with the same feeling, concept of the song. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Sometimes more. Sometimes more. Very significant in, in time. Yeah. I mean, especially now after 25 years, the songs that we play in our concert are the are the really our best ones, you know. So we. We we love them, you know. We don't we don't expect everybody to love our music. That's not how life works. But we really do. So if we play a song like Yellow, yes, it's because we still really love playing it, and uh, and we're so grateful for what it's given us. the people that helps you in the show? Well, first of all, we don't really care about nationalities or borders. So we work with people who are special everywhere. And every audience is special all around the world. So we don't really focus on somebody's... Because he's Argentine. But we don't focus on somebody's nationality. But it is true that we have a close relationship with a lot of Argentine people and Perhaps that's because we feel it's easy to feel the warmth, you know, that there's something. It's the same with the audience. Like every audience we play for is incredible all around the world. Here, there's just like un poquito más abierto, right? And so it's más fácil por nosotros. Yes, something right? you said that the, we don't care about nationalities or countries, but um, there are some countries that, like you say, like Iran, that has this. Um, troubles or, or some yeah. freedom and special with women, no? Mm -hmm. In these moments that we are talking about free and to express and yeah. to be just one, there they they just can't. So many places. Not only in Iran, obviously. Yeah. Even today in Nigeria, some crazy stuff happening with two kids that made a joke on TikTok. And now they're being uh, and punished. And it's so, I think that makes you just feel so, first of all, it makes you feel very motivated to keep singing about freedom and love. And sending love. Yeah, and secondly, it makes you realize how lucky we are, you know, where we were born, what language we speak, when we were born, where we're able to go because yes. of this passport. So. We realize that everything we have is a gift, everything. And uh, that's, that's why I think we have an extra kind of energy these days. That you're like opinion leaders and you have these um, before the show, the, 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 the big screens where you uh, put these videos where these organizations uh, are working uh, with uh, trying to fix a little bit our planet. How important, important is that I never seen in, in a show before that a band put these big screens with this organization doing this hard work. Well, I think it was important for us that we, well, that when we went on tour again, and we are on tour, that we made it as sustainable as, as possible because we realized that maybe in the past we talked about causes and charities, but we hadn't 
hadn't really focused on ourselves and what, what we could be doing better. And so this time we wanted to really focus on actually what we could change about what we do and how we do it. Now the most important thing, who is going to win the World Cup, the Football <laughs> World Cup, England or Argentina with Messi? <laughs> Or Germany, to... you can say anyone. <laughs> I think England and Argentina are going to get to the final. <laughs> this is what will happen. No. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> they'll get to the final. It will be 3-3 three, three at full time. Yeah. Then there'll be extra time. And then penalties. Wait, two more goals. Then penalties. Nobody will miss a penalty. <laughs> They will have to do something extra. The game will last for 10 years. <laughs> and eventually they will decide to share the cup. <laughs>